Hello everyone, we are going to discuss the term Soxlet Extractor. What is Soxlet Extractor? It is a piece of laboratory apparatus designed for the extraction of lipid from solid material. You can see the diagram of Soxlet Extractor. Soxlet Extractor is invented in 1879 by Franz von Soxlet. When we we'll use Soxlet Extractor, it is used when the desired compound has limited solubility in solvent and the impurity is insoluble in that solvent. What are the main sections of Soxlet Extractor? There are three main sections of Soxlet Extractor. Number one is percolator, which is also known as boiler and reflux, which circulates the solvent. Number two is thimble. Thimble usually made of thick filter paper. It retains the solid to be extracted. Number third is siphon mechanism, which periodically empties the thimble. Next, we are going to discuss assembly of Soxlet extractor. How to assemble Soxlet extractor? There are few main points which shows how we can assemble Soxlet extractor. Source is placed inside the thimble. Thimble is loaded onto the main chamber. Extraction solvent to be used is placed in distillation flask. Flask is placed onto the heating element. Soxlet extractor placed at the top of the flask. Reflux condenser is then placed at the top of the flask. Reflex condenser is then placed at the top of the extractor. In the next diagram, you will see the schematic representation of Soxlet extractor. This is the diagram of assembled Soxlet extractor. There are numbering from 1 to 11, which shows some main points. Number 1 is stirrer bar. This is in yellow color. Number two point is still port. Still port should not be overfilled and volume of solvent into it should be three to four times the volume of Soxlet chamber. Number three point shows distillation path. Number four point shows thimble. Number five point is that point in which the solid is loaded. Number six point shows siphon top. Number seven point siphon exit. Number 8, expansion adopter. Number 9 is condenser in which cooling takes place. Number 10 point shows the point where the water is going out. And the 11 point shows where the water is going inside the condenser. Operation of Soxlet extractor. You can see the diagram of Soxlet extractor. It shows how it works. Now we are going to discuss that cycle which shows the operation of Soxlet extractor. Firstly, the solvent is heated to reflux. After that, solvent vapor travels up the distillation arm and floods into the chamber housing the thimble of solid. Condenser ensures that any solvent vapor cools and drip back down into the chamber housing solid materials. Chamber containing solid material slowly fills with warm water. When Soxlet chamber is almost full, chamber is emptied by siphon. Solvent is returned to the distillation flask. Thimble ensures that the rapid motion of solvent doesn't transport any solid material to the still pore. This cycle repeats many times. Cycle is repeated many times until the desired compound is concentrated in the distillation flask. What will happen after the extraction is completed? Solvent is removed by means of rotary evaporator yielding extracted compounds and the non-soluble portion of extracted solid remains in the thimble and is usually discarded. This is all about Soxlet Extractor. Thank you so much.